Good morning, dear friends. Uh, welcome to our channel, English Ways. Uh, this is Hassan Aziz. Now, let us go back to the continuation of the topic now. In this session, you are going to know how to use an apostrophe with a noun. Generally, while reading any newspaper or if you prepare for any competitive level, if you want to understand an apostrophe, you have to follow this video, how to use an apostrophe in the sentence. If you know how to use an apostrophe in the sentence, it is given the complete meaning of the sentence and it shows how the relation of the each word in the sentence. Okay, let us see how that will be. Here, once you see the first boys hostel, boys hostel, girls hostel, girls hostel, women's hostel, women's hostel, women's hostel. In this case, one thing you remember, one thing you pay attention, especially boy, B-O-Y, boy. Once you get to know whether it is a singular or plural, it is totally singular. It is totally singular. How to use an apostrophe to the singular here? B O Y apostrophe yes. Boys hostel. It is a right format to apply. Wherever you require to write with a single noun, how to use an apostrophe by following this format. The second one you see. Boys hostel. What is the difference between B O Y B O Y S? Here it indicates plural noun boys apostrophe and S. Okay, but when you apply like this, it is grammatically wrong expression. It is grammatically wrong expression because B O Y S. Boys indicate plural. Any noun which ends with plural word that is S, after that you mention apostrophe, no need to mention yes after apostrophe. If you mention yes after apostrophe, that is wrong usage in the sentence. Okay, as you see here, it is wrong sentence. If you want to say the same sentence in the right manner, in the right way, you have to follow this one. B O Y S. B O Y Yes. Boys hostel. Boys hostel. You see here plural boys apostrophe. No need to mention yes after apostrophe. If you mention yes, it is wrong usage. It is wrong usage. Which is, the, which is the right one? It is the right one. Any plural noun. Boys hostel. As you see, girls hostel. The same format. What I gave you, boys hostel. The same format here also you follow, girls hostel. It is also wrong usage. It is also wrong usage. How do you say the same thing like this? Girls. Girls hostel. Girls hostel. As you see, girls plural noun. After that, you put question marker. Girls apostrophe. No need to mention yes after apostrophe. If you mention yes, it is wrong usage. Both will be the same. Boys hostel, girls hostel. The uses will be the same. The uses also the same. Next, as you see, girls hostel. Girls hostel, it indicates a singular noun. A singular noun. You see, G-I-R-L apostrophe, yes. Girls hostel, it is right format to apply. Because 
it doesn't follow any plural it will be as a singular that's why it is the right usage to apply and next to you see women's hostel whether it is a singular or plural once you decide w o m e a n apostrophe yes women's hostel basically it is a singular after singular what do you apply apostrophe and s marker women's hostel it is right usage it is right usage next one women's hostel w o m e a n apostrophe yes hostel women's hostel generally once you see women singular women is a plural once you see women is a singular women is a plural once you see the spelling of plural noun you see w o m e a n it doesn't end with s marker that's why you can apply apostrophe along with yes women's hostel right format women's hostel it will be the right format because it doesn't follow especially plural noun where it ends with s marker that's why you can apply women apostrophe yes for for example you see children children how do you mention an apostrophe apostrophe yes apostrophe yes the same case women's hostel children's hostel the same case you can apply because it indicates plural en here also en indicates plural okay that's why you can apply apostrophe and s marker children's hostel women's hostel the last one you see women's hostel w o m e e n s apostrophe yes it is absolutely wrong expression why it is wrong expression basically in the spelling and the usage both will be wrong in the spelling women itself it is a plural noun no need to mention yes okay and similarly no need to apply any kind of apostrophe like this example that's why it is absolutely wrong expression okay like that you see first format as you see singular boys girls singular boys hostel girls hostel it is one format as plural nouns boys hostel it is wrong boys hostel it is a right expression to say b o y s apostrophe no need to mention s boys hostel girls hostel okay let us see again the plural noun women's hostel as a singular women's hostel as plural like this you follow when you follow this format especially whenever you want to mention any apostrophe while writing any sentence or any drafting your writing will be more effective while using these kind of expressions and now you see other examples by following compound noun fathers in law house here in the previous class i told you by following these relations brother in law sister in law daughter in law okay it is the common expression where you apply in day to day conversation and in day to day writing and similarly you see by following this how to use an apostrophe by following this compound noun basically in the first example we are using apostrophe father apostrophe yes brother apostrophe yes sister apostrophe yes daughter apostrophe yes 
But when you see these expressions, they are absolutely wrong expressions. They are absolutely wrong expressions, as you see. But how they use them an apostrophe by following this compound noun, we have to follow like this. Father in laws. End part of the word. L A W apostrophe yes. L A W apostrophe yes. Brother in laws health. Sister in laws opinion. Daughter in laws suggestion. Like this, you can apply an apostrophe with a compound noun. Like this, you never apply with a compound noun, especially by following relations. Okay, I mean to say that here you get to know L A W S apostrophe S apostrophe S apostrophe S like this. If you see this format, it is absolutely wrong expression. I mean, uh, if you apply any competitive level in order to identify spotting errors, where the error is located in the sentence, if you see like this, it is grammatically wrong usage. It is grammatically wrong usage. How to rectify that? Like this. How to rectify that? Like this. Even for this also, you remember, if you see any noun, any singular noun and plural noun, how to use an apostrophe, we have to follow this method. Especially the students who are preparing for uh, SSC, banking, catch, or any some other competitive level, either state level or central level, they ask you the questions where whether it is the right answer or wrong answer. By following four options, if you know this format, you can evaluate the meaning of the sentence by following four options, you get to know the right answer when you know how to use an apostrophe with a noun. Okay, dear friends, please subscribe our channel in order to update your knowledge and skills. Okay, let us see the